I met with random and diverse Americans, including a pair of strippers by the airport, an elderly woman and her caretaker daughter, two hipsters who hang out in a coffee house, and a traditional conservative Christian couple, and I gave them each their chance to exercise their freedom of speech. I'm Patrick Bristow, and this is Patrick Bristow's Freakdom of Speech. So ladies, how do you feel about our culture of celebrity? The world is like a high school quad. Everybody wants to hang out with the popular kids. Celebrities are the popular kids. The fastest way to get famous is to throw a brick at someone famous. I know someone famous said that, I don't know who. I mean, as long as you have the talent to throw a brick, you have a shot. I think we have a couple celebrities that we, <laughs> we enjoy. They say the teeth are the window to the spirit. Yes. They're like dogs. They sense each other and they introduce themselves to each other. Some Rhea Shriver meet Christian Slater. How's that work out? What do they got to talk about? Oh, I bit my girlfriend's stomach. Oh, I my think husband's it's, the governor. It's just a case of mutual recognition. That's why brothers say suck to each other. I threw a brick at Charlize Theron because she... Did you? Um, yeah. What happened? She was driving by my house and I had a brick. Are there any celebrities who you think should not be celebrities? Paris Hilton, Paris. Lionel Richie's daughter, Placido and Domingo, Nicole Richie, Every Spice Girl, Lionel Richie's daughter, Yeah, Nicole Richie. What is your obsession with Lionel Richie's daughter? Britney Spears. I put her down in the hurricane cellar and lock the door and just say, oh no, that one died at birth. Mm -hmm. And I'm not kidding. And that's happened. I'm gonna throw out some names, you just give me reactions. Lindsay Lohan. Who? Lesbian. Parent trap. Booze whore. But somehow really likable. <laughs> Robert Downey Jr. Crazy eyes. Hot, hot, hot. He could be getting out of a limo, he could be sleeping in the gutter. Woo! <laughs> Every morning you don't know. Yeah. And that's fun. Wouldn't kick him out of bed for eating crackers. Talk to me about accidental celebrities. As far as John Bonet Ramsey goes, I mean, there's a little girl who wanted fame and got it. Got it. You don't always get to pick the package your present nope. comes in. I guess Judas is a celebrity if you go by that definition. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And I would not watch his show. Mm -hmm. No. Charlie Manson? He wasn't a celebrity, though. Mm. He was a serial killer. And a good kisser. If Charles Manson were on a reality show today, which one would you put him on? America's Biggest Loser. Because if Charlie is a judge, and I know how Charlie can get, I'm not eating that week. I picture him more as like a wisecracking neighbor on a sitcom where he goes, why don't they kill me already? I also think he'd be a good stand-up comic. Because he has such a skewed perspective. <laughs> I made a bull. Um, I made should I? Stinky. Okay. okay, Mother, we, we know. Just five. Just, uh, gotta take five, okay. ten, fifteen, maybe. Oh, Lord, Mother. I think we need to reduce our dependence on foreign oil because we're wasting a lot of energy flying oil from Saudi Arabia to here. 